Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the BBG, but this time, Illusion Connect now. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, of course. I will be going into this game a bit more because actually it was Immortal Towers. It just kept showing me this ad over and over and over and over again. And I'm literally forced to watch 30 seconds of it. And I've, I've watched all of the trailers for it. It's like two or three different ones over and over again. And I was like, fine, damn it, fine, I'll do it. I downloaded it and turns out new as hell global release game kind of similar to kingdom of heroes but it's basically a waifu collector i'll be honest with you it's basically a waifu collector it's just the way it is now i'm gonna just show you the combat first of all because it's a little bit different but it's also really cool sort of reminds me of ark knights as well yes i've played a lot of mobile games ladies and gentlemen yes i have but we are going to go straight in. So I've done the tutorial. I'm level 4. I, I did all that simply because I needed to know what the hell was going on. <laughs> and so the battle begins like this. You get a certain amount of... Oh yeah, get him! So time waits for no man here. I actually have to constantly add people into it in order to do the fighting properly. Oh, that was cool. Get in there, smash him. Oh shit. So everyone's got different skills and all that, of course. Hell yeah. I've already done a 10 summon thing. I got an SSR character. You do get a. You, you get given a super, super rare character. I'll be honest with you. You get given it. I'm assuming the one you get given is random. I ended up getting a DPS um, super, super rare, which I am very happy about. But I'm gonna have to actually. No, I need to change the fucking. Hang on. Oh, fine. ナイトメアを根絶するほどの強さや運命と対抗できる強さも足りないみんなを守りきれないあ、記録。Yep. So, yeah, as you can see, I'm still doing the tutorial itself. Yep, yep, yep. Skills, etc. There you go, have Oh, what do you mean? Look, I don't even have you in my team anymore, I don't think. Like, hang on. Get my super, super rare going on. Now, this lady is incredibly strong. Straight to level 8. Do I really know what I'm doing? I do not, but the sheer amount of stuff you can do in this game is astounding. Yes, I am going to level my super rare. Oh, nice. Oh, damn, you can move him around. What? Oh, I can make thumbnails before I fucking look at this. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's going to be... the th Wait. Wait. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, it's not quite the same. Well, I could put... There's a thumbnail. <laughs> That's sick. So yeah, basically a waifu collector this game. Now... Gotta do... Got to get rid of all these tutorial missions so I can properly explore the game, but I'm really enjoying it so far. I honestly, never would have thought Immortal Towers would give me a good game, but it has a couple of times now. Is this a boss? Hey, that's my character. What the? F uh, yeah, Guardian. Gonna chuck you there because she attacks everything in a column. Ow. You get wrecked. And just because, chuck my super super rare in there. I don't need to, but I'm gonna win. Holy crap. Yeah. 
Yes, beautiful. I do enjoy turn-based games, and it's made even more interesting than the fact that skills only play when you actually put a person into play. Nothing stops for it. So if you just let your guy attack, you're going to die, basically. Encounter Jasmine, what's this? Oh, oh okay, yep. Yeah. So, standard stuff. Now, I received so much goodies, so I'm going to actually go into my inventory and retrieve them. Uh, yeah, these. What are these? Open. Open. What have I done? Oh, God. What have I done? It's frozen! What? Oh, Jesus. Oh, what's happening? <laughs> what's happening? Oh, I see. Oh, yes, this is for the intimacy interface for all of that. So as you level up your partners, you will have to increase intimacy. I noticed during the tutorial, making choices for just doing, making decisions on what to do literally increases the intimacy depending on what you chose for the characters that you're talking to. Be interesting to see how that affects anything. I'm going to try and... Intimacy, what is it good for? I don't know. We've got skins. Of course. Of course there's skins. <laughs> of course there is. Although I suppose I should just wait for the bloody tutorial to teach me intimacy because it's gone through pretty much everything so far. Warm breezes and happy smiles. Joy is so sweet and wonderful that it tastes like ice cream. What a paradise. Well... A nightmare lord, sure. Yeah, that's exactly my nightmare lord. Hey, look, it, it, random intimacy. Dream absorbs the desires of humans from reality, amplifies them, and yeah, when we have to kill them. See, it doesn't seem to matter what thing I click, it just gives me intimacy. Maybe one option is a slightly higher intimacy for a different character, not too sure so far. We should really handle this as soon as possible, I'm not gonna lie. Like, he is asking for trouble, but... We should. Jasmine is the Nightmare Lord, yeah, figures. Figures. I was right! We found a new frame light in the dream, let's put it into our home. Yeah, so you've got an entire home system. Literally every single square is customizable. No joke. What can I build? Frame light. Nightmares will perform a reaction similar to photosynthesis and eventually secrete XP. <laughs> That's sick. Alright. Uh... Oh, I'll move it later. Nice. Extra furniture is always good. Because it gives me money and XP an hour. And there is an idle option for this, but you do have to be quite a decent player at it, I would say. Oh, I see. You can just claim directly from there. That's cool. That's cool. Alright. Straight back into it. It's a healer, eh? Powerful support, they say. Well, look. What happens if I do that? And then that. Get stunned. Holy shit, that was a strong one. Freaking heal 4k, are you joking me? Hey. 
Beautiful. There's so much voice acting in here. Training. What? Oh, I see. You can test people. Okay, that's cool. I'm going to test it purely because this is one of the, I suppose, pay to win things that you can buy. So you can outright buy this Phoenix character. All right. Jesus. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay. That's fine. I guess. Jesus. Okay, now what I am going to try and do, I'm going to get to summoning. Please let me summon. Please let me summon. Yes. All right. Now, which is the best one? That's the real question, like, who do I want? I kind of want... Kind of want these ones, because these guys are technically bad guys. I've already versed that Asha Ashwaya during the tutorial. He summons ghosts and shit, that's awesome. Uh, okay, yeah, look. I'm doing it. Super, super rare, super, super rare, come on. Well, look. Right, right. Holy shit. Sixteen to play you, fucking hell, that is a very expensive character. If it's R, I don't care, get out of it. Hello. Puppeteer. Another one. It's a lot of super rares. But it's not a lot of super super rares. Alright. Now, let's have a look. What do you do? That's the real question. Damage to light and spell class enemies increases by 33%. Jesus. Triggers an explosion. Can't use my... Oh my god. This is a very specific class. If someone has a full team of light or spell, they're dead. Wow. Welcome <laughs> Attacks a single enemy and deals attack 330%. Also summons mermaid, princess, and ice queen to battle. Jesus. What do you mean? I have to test them all. That's the fucking problem. Uh, where's the super rig on? I don't think I will be high enough level to actually put these guys on my lineup because you do have a limit. You see 42 out of 70 at the top left there, so I've got to really be smart. Like, <laughs> alright, I'm going to replace you. And this, she is, Hato is a really, really, really specific character, but I'm going to try her out. Then there's just me as a leader, being shit at the back line. <laughs> oh, there's so much in this game that I've just not done. I'm pretty sure I'm still on the tutorial, technically. But I'm gonna fuck these guys up. I got at least super rare, full team. Fuck all you. Fuck you all. It's literally, I keep versing the people I get, that's hilarious. Uh, wait, no, I'm gonna get tank first, and then super rare. <laughs> Wrong place to summon your puppets. <laughs> Oh, 
I can see the use of those puppets. Bloody, gotta make it look good, you know? Uh, where can I put this one? More! Literally just gonna try and get as many as I can. Gotta level. Absolutely destroying my resources, but you know, you can never have enough dessert carts. <laughs> All right, that will do for now. Probably. It's warehouse. What is warehouse? Oh, okay. That's for furniture that I actually find out and about, as opposed to outright buying it. Okay. How much does it cost to summon just with gold or oh, diamonds, I should say? Ah. I see, so I have to outright buy nine summon tickets. That is rough. 1600, almost there though. On to the next. <laughs> Alice in Wonderland. That's great. You're all gonna die though. Oh, Nightmare Alice. Oh god. Kill her. Eye of Horus. Oh shit. Oh! Oh! Alright, alright. Claim. Thank you. So you obviously upgrade those three main ones you get up to SSR as it's been saying in the old loading screen. So does that mean they would be good super super rares? Because, you know, historically speaking you get a rare character and you level it to SSR, it's still going to be less effective than a character that started at super, super rare, you know? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Let's just... She must be very determined. <laughs> All right, yeah, I'll guide her back to reality with my sword.
You're gonna make the Nightmare Lord go crazy. Okay, well. Not all Nightmare Lords are monsters, yeah. I'm not. How rude. Chapter cleared! Chapter 3 unlocked. Beautiful. I really like how it scrolls as well, like, for the chapters. It's just really well polished, it really is. So, I have to... Alright. So obviously. Okay, I get it. I get it. Stop talking. I get it. Shh. Shh. Shut it. <laughs> so, I'm going to leave this little short episode here. It's really just a first look at it. But wow. Surprisingly incredibly polished. I can't really get anywhere at the moment because I need to complete at least chapter four, it would seem. And I've only just done chapter three. So perhaps the start of four is where it sort of actually gets into the proper game. Either way, oh, I can't even unlock. Yeah, five five for that, just to unlock elite. I don't even know what that does. But we'll get there, ladies and gentlemen. We will get there. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Leave me a like, leave me a comment. I'm going to get back into doing these campaign missions. <laughs> As always, have a great day.